two shootings on the same street, a few blocks and five minutes apart. Three men shot, one fatally, on West Polk Street in Lawndale in broad daylight. There were at least 44 people shot in Chicago from about 6.30 p.m. Saturday through 6.30 p.m. Sunday night, according to information from the Chicago Police Department. Seven of those shot died from their wounds, making it an incredibly violent 24 hours. Detectives are responding to the incidents but also trying to determine potential motive and those that may be retaliatory in nature, said Anthony Guglielmi, spokesman for CPD. After the two shootings in South Austin in the 5600 block of West Madison Street, in which one person was shot, and then in the 5400 block of West Madison Street, in which two people were shot, police had to question whether one was retaliation for the other. Can't say yet, we're exploring that possibility given the geography and timing, Guglielmi wrote in a text. Ten minutes later, a call went out requesting ambulances respond to three more people shot at the intersection of Madison Street and Central Avenue, the same area of South Austin. A total of six people had been shot in the area in three separate shootings within about two hours. In earlier shootings Sunday, a man, 20, was shot in the 5100 block of West North Avenue in North Austin, officials said. About 4.50 p.m. he was shot in the lower right leg, and he showed up at West Suburban Medical Center, where he was listed in good condition. Police said they believe the victim may be a gang member, and they continue to investigate. No arrests had been made. A 49-year-old man was shot in the back as he stood in the 10,600 block of South Green Bay Avenue in the East Side neighborhood when a light-colored minivan pulled up and a man wearing all black jumped out of the minivan, covered his face and shot the victim, before getting back in the minivan, officials said. The man was taken to Advocate Christ Medical Center in Oak Lawn, where he was listed in critical condition. A man, 24 was in critical condition at Strager Hospital after being shot in the face and the abdomen, authorities said. He was found in the 2300 block of West 21st Street in heart of Chicago about 1.15 p.m., officials said. The man told police a few men in a dark-colored sedan came at him, with their shirts covering their faces, and opened fire on him. Then they took off, he said. No arrests had been made. Authorities continue to investigate. A 27-year-old in West Englewood was shot in the left ankle and right arm, police said. He was taken to Strager Hospital for treatment about 8.46 a.m., officials said. The man told police he was standing in the 5700 block of South Paulina Street when a man got out of a dark-colored sedan and came up to him on foot, officials said. After shooting at the man, the gunman took off in an unknown direction. No one had been arrested, and authorities said the man who was shot has gang affiliation. At 8 a.m., a 40-year-old man was in the 1400 block of South Holman Avenue when he was shot in the left thigh in the Lawndale neighborhood. He arrived at Mount Sinai Hospital where emergency responders stabilized his condition. No one had been arrested, and detectives were investigating. The Sunday shootings were part of a particularly violent weekend that saw two triple shootings Saturday. At least 33 people were wounded, six fatally, within 13 hours from Saturday to Sunday across the city in separate shootings, which include an attack in the West Pullman neighborhood that left one man dead and wounded six other people, authorities said.